guys, in today's video, I will going to transform your Android device into an iOS device. Now, all you have to do is to connect your internet connection, and you must have an internet connection. And basically, before proceeding the procedure, all you have to do is click the link in the description below in order to download everything. And uh, without further ado, let's get started. So all you have to do is to go to your browser and uh, just basically first is to root your device. So we're gonna be downloading a Kingo root application which is from Kingo root and just basically download that and um, just wait for that. So when you're done downloading the file all you have to do is to go to your settings and check the uh, unknown sources box you must check that in order to install an application that comes from a known source and just next 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 and install and click accept And open the root, the single root, and click one click root. So the links are in the description, just download and install Flashify because we were going to, to uh, flash a custom recovery on your Android device, on your Hawaii Wi-Fi 11. So when you're done in downloading the Flashify, just install it and um, when done installing, just uh, open it because we will going to install a custom recovery and maybe you could check the I understand box, just check, check that and click install. It will actually take a uh, short time maybe and um let's just wait for that and just click open if it's done and accept so guys in case you didn't root your device you actually d can't um can't flash a custom recovery and um please Click the link in the description below if you haven't clicked yet and just download all the files. And this is a TWRP and we we're gonna be flashing it and just click that and yup. Follow this video and um, just basically download the TWRP which is in the link in the description below. All the needed files in here are in the link in the description below and if you haven't downloaded the custom ROM which is the ROM iOS just basically click and download and remain and leave it as a zip file so it's flashing right now and nope it's rebooting so just follow what I did here and just wipe first and wipe your cache and swipe to wipe back and factor reset and swipe so the next thing so the next thing you we will going to do is uh, to flash 
the ROM which is to install it from SD card which is the uh, ROM iOS and click install and find the ROM iOS that zip and remain it as a zip file or else it won't work and click that and swipe it to confirm flash so this uh, process will take actually maybe 15 to 10 minutes and it depends on your uh, depends on you but just wait for that and take your time and uh, be patient and it's actually installing right now so um, actually it's not an English I can't understand what is written here all I know I understand is the in this installing um, but in case it doesn't matter so just click next and next and reboot your system so it's rebooting right now Oh my god, it looks like an iOS, really? Is this real? And go to my settings and try to change the language because... Oh, I can't understand all of them. Oh, where are you? Where can I change my language? Maybe in the Bahasa? Bahasa and input? that's actually and change that to English of course I'm not an, I'm not uh, an English but I have to change this to English so here is the about So as you can see the notification there, it really looks like an iOS device but that notification there is uh, maybe a, what do you call that application, it's an app and modified, it's a custom ROM so it's a ROM and modified everything like an iOS, as you can see all the icons like app store settings, message, and all the names like the browser safari i'm using the safari right now which is not a real safari it is really not a real ios we're not running on the real ios of course and it should we should not be running on a real ios because it's still running on android and the app store there will not work actually of course so the here is the camera and as you can see my green screen there and that's me smile so as you can see it really looks cool Just
basically leave a comment below.